welcome to the Clary Tale. It is currently 6.50 and we are in the car on our way to Volcano Bay. We went last night to City Walk to buy our tickets and we were told that we have to come um, to Volcano Bay for 7.30 because otherwise it reaches full capacity and we won't be allowed in. So that is why we are here super early. We might be a little bit late but fingers crossed it'll be okay still. I definitely still feel half asleep. <laughs> How about you? I'm definitely three quarters asleep. <laughs> You've got your coffee, so we're all good. We went and nicked and dunk him to get him a coffee. <laughs> um, but yeah, hopefully having a fun day in Volcano Bay. Um, I obviously won't be able to show you everything because we're going to be in the water. Um, but I'll have a little walk around with the camera to show you the park and then maybe then we'll go for a splash and then come back again and I'll tell you about each like, sort of slide and stuff. But yeah, really excited for this day. It's going to be so much fun. It was only $100 to upgrade my preferred pass to include this third park and one day ticket plus hacks is about 70 something so it made sense for me to upgrade it in case if I go one more time it pays for itself so ah really excited so we'll see a volcano bay here it is it's so cool that you can see it from the road Enough now. Oh, and this is the new pass. So that is the three. That's the three park preferred pass. So we are in the queue. It's not too long because we we're here quite early. So we're going to go through security here, and then we get onto one of these really big volcano bay buses, which are cool. But the queue's already gone all the way around here and around there now, so definitely get here early if you can. And we're going in, everyone just cheered and clapped. <laughs> there are now four buses ready to take us in. Tappers, let's see a tapper tapo. <laughs> We've got a very attractive tan colour. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I don't know where we're going. Look at that. Look at the volcano. Oh my gosh, it's humongous. It doesn't look as big as that from the road. No. Right, so we'll run to your right and then we'll go and grab some. That's quite a we? Yeah. Oh, look. We're coming in here, we're gonna um, just grab grab a drink because I'm parched. And it looks like we can use these, which is brilliant. There's some freestyle machines over there. So we are changed, we're just putting all our stuff in the locker, including you. So I'll pick you up after we've done a few rides. Hi guys, I've just taken you out of the locker. So it is half 11, we've done quite a few slides already, which is exciting. Um, we've done, I'll just talk you through which ones we've done as I walk past them, uh, but I thought I'd get you out and show you around a little bit. So here is the volcano, how good is that? And it couldn't quite show you properly as we walked in. But look at that. Isn't it spectacular? Look at that. Someone's definitely snoring. He's snoring. This, uh, this guy is snoring. Guy. Look at him. Uh, he's singing. 
So yeah, this is where you come in. There's a lazy river here as well. And then I'm gonna walk around and show you some of the slides now. But that tube there, I don't know if you can see it. I don't even know if you can hear me over this Easter man. Look at that tube right there. Look at that, oh my gosh. We haven't ridden that yet, so I'm really excited to go on there. We are actually currently in the line to ride that ride because here we've got, can you see that, 115 minutes until we can ride that one. <laughs> so yeah, this park is so, so clever. I just can't believe it. So um, we were able to ride a few things because of how clever this park is with this ma this, this band, I know it's a magic band there, with the Tapu Tapu. So these two are some of our favorite ones. Can you see there, that's where you go vertical and down again. And there's another one up there. And then this green one was really good as well. These curves were so fast, we actually felt dizzy. It was so good. And then there's a lazy river down here. And some, the these, yeah, they're the family cabanas. This might be a better view of that same slide. So that's where you go up. And then that's the green one, and then all the, the float things go up that way. How good is that? The rafts. Yeah. Yeah. So, so much fun. So that, that one's called Honu, and that's the one we did very at the very beginning, so we had no wait for that one. Now it's up to about 200 minute wait. Look at these crocodiles on this bridge, it's so cute! <laughs> to get our food so I thought I would walk around a little bit and show you some more slides. Uh, this is the little tots area. So there are actually three slides that are in the volcano itself. Two of them um, sort of so basically all three of them start like this and then they the floor drops and you just go down it's just amazing um, and I've, we've done one of them and um, it drops but then it angles off a bit and then it goes round and round and round and it was so so scary um, but there's also another one called the Ko Akiri and that one is the one I showed you uh, that's the clear tube down it just goes straight down <laughs> a bit like Summit Plummet in Blizzard Beach so yeah that is Super, super scary. I'm really, 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 really excited to try that. Um, so, where else should I show you? So you do come out here, there's a wave pool. This is where you come out of the Ko Akuri one, where you just go straight down and out here. Um, and then there's a wave pool that's just over there, which looks really good. Over there. These are the little cabanas, which seem really cool. And then this is the way up into the volcano. So I'll show you the volcano itself now. We're going in the volcano itself. Although there's definitely mist in here, so I probably shouldn't be taking you in here. Right, I'm going to turn you off and I'll see you on the other side. 
literally like a good five, 15 meters of mist right there. So I just walked all the way through there in the mist. And then this is the other side. So we've got massive volcano. And then that goes down into the wave pool. Good, hey? I just did the colour, which was, I think that's the blue one, or the Tainau, whichever the blue one is. Oh no, I did the green one, because it's a bit steeper, the green one, so we did that one. Um, yeah, so, I'm going to go back through the volcano, back to Simon, see if he's ordered our hot dog. is that there's a lazy river and a fearless river. The fearless river has like a faster current and then there's loads of stuff that come in that like loads of water. There's loads of bubbles, like really jacuzzi-ish. Like the fearless river is so much fun. One of our absolutely favorite uh, rides so far, it's called the Krakatau. It is so good. It's an aqua coaster and you go up and down about six times and the acceleration you feel when it goes up is so much fun and then you just drop. Um, this is the, what it's called, uh, and let's see if I can show you a bit of it, that's where you queue, here we go, I can show you, so it literally goes up really fast and then down really fast and it happens about six times in the whole ride, it's so much fun, and um, it's definitely one of Man and Simon's highlights so far. Did you see that? Here it comes. <laughs> and it shoots you back up again. So cool. So those orange and black ones, we've not actually done those ones yet, so they're gonna be next. They're ones that you go on the mat, so you lie down, front down on the mat. And then there's also two other slides we've not done yet. Um, oh yeah and oh no. And the exciting thing about oh yeah and oh no is that you finish the, the slide and then it drops you and you just plunge down with nothing on you, you just jump, it's brilliant. So I think that's the fearless one because it seems to be a very sort of rocky. So these slides here, these ones are the tan wide tubes I think it is and it's dual and these turns are so tight that you end up going around so so quickly and then um, Simon got off and was like whoa my head he really felt the g-force on it and you really do you I got off feeling so lightheaded because you're literally going like this and um, that was but actually I think that's been one of my favorite ones I, I think I've said that after every ride um, but yeah that's sort of a little tour for you while Simon's been in the line for our hot dog uh, he's nearly near the front now so next thing you'll see is our massive hot dog it's a foot long so this is where we're coming to eat wacko wack wow i don't even know how to say that and we're gonna get a hot dog i think to share we're finally here and we're gonna get a foot long hot dog the pizzas look really good though here we go then we've got our hot dog we got some crisps and a brookie. Look at that brookie. And then we've refilled the um, freestyle with some cherry pib. Look at that, it looks delicious. So that pizza you just saw in the last clip, basically the hot dog was absolutely just, it was inedible, like we couldn't eat it. The, the bread was really hard and the sausage was not nice. Um, and the lady was so kind that she let us swap it for the pizza. 
Um, so I'm so, so glad because that pizza was one of the best pizzas I think I've had out here. It was so good. Um, while I was sort of getting up and down trying to sort that out, I pinged off my bikini top. So, well obviously I'm wearing one still, I just don't have the strap. So, I'm going to swap over. Luckily I brought a spare one. I don't know why I even did that. It was like I knew it was going to happen. <laughs> um, so we're just going to go back to changing rooms. We're going to change my bikini and then we're going to head on to the next slide. So we've, got, we've still got a couple of minutes until um, our one on our wristband. So, we did a few more slides after lunch. We were did Oh No and Oh No was so good. It's, it's actually quite a tame slide but there's a 10 foot drop as you finish and you just go flying. It was so much fun. Um, and then we did some other, what else? Things that we do after lunch. We did, uh, we did the, big, the big six person oh, one yeah. with yellow. Malu, Malu. Ma yeah, Ma something like that. And it was, yeah, six person. And you just kept rocking up and down the sides like this. And you're almost vertical, it was so much fun. And then there was, we did the one, all three that are in the volcano, we've done all those. It's just so, they're like really extreme rides here. They're so, so good. I loved every bit of them. And we rode the one with the, with, the, with the spins, the spirally one, because that one was one that you can ride now. You don't have to do your tapu tapu because it's always constantly moving. So that, we did that a few more times. So we did three of the slides out of the four. Um, yeah, we've managed to do nearly everything. But as you can see, we're on our way out now. It's 6 p.m. So actually, you know, we woke up at 6 a.m. <laughs> this has been like a 12 hour. But yeah, no, it's been so, so good. It's starting to get a bit windy now. I think there might be a storm coming. So we've had perfect weather, but perfect timing for stuff. Um, the only thing that we was the longest thing was waiting for lunch. But that actually turned out great because I was able to show you guys everything. Well, half half the park anyway, while, while we were while Simon was in line to get our food. But yeah, so, did you enjoy, what was your favourite slide? Um, oh, so I liked the canoe one, which was the Cracker Tower, yeah, uh, the four coaster. person ca canoe coaster. The aqua coaster. Yeah, that's so, the best so one good. by far. I also did like inside the volcano. Yeah, the, um, inside there. Yeah, they have the single drop ones where the floor just moves out. And I did and like those ones. <laughs> The green and the clear Your plastic Your heart just one. goes, doesn't it? Because yeah. you don't know when the floor's going to go. So okay. there's no timing. And the one that just single shoots down. Did you hear the music in that little thing? Yeah. There's music building up and then suddenly it goes. It's so good. Um, I'm just going to buy myself a Volcano Bay pin because I collect pins. And it'll be nice for the collection, won't it? Because yeah, we've just had such a good day and I want to remember it by... Remember it with a pin. This is the pin I bought. Ooh, I love it. Goodbye, Volcano Bay. I've had a lovely, lovely day. It's been so good. Everything has been my favourite ride was. I think. Oh, it's so hard because every single one I rode, I was like, that's my best one, that's my favourite one. I think it's going to be, because we did it a few times, the one where you went like this and you really felt the speed. Because I've never been on a water ride where you're going as fast as that. You had G-Force on it. Yeah. Really good. That was the two-seater one, wasn't it? Yeah. Really good. Like, it's like extreme water park and there's never, there's never been anything like it. It's so, so good. Um, so yeah. And the theming in general of this park is so brilliant. How good are all the, the plants and the, the volcanoes? Look at this! <laughs> so, so good. So yeah, it's been a successful trip. And I've got an annual pass now, so I can come back another time, which I'm definitely, definitely going to do. So yeah, all in all, it's been a lovely, lovely day. So, thank you so much for watching. Definitely come and visit Volcano Bay, you'll love it. And yeah, 